Basketball has always been a passion of mine. I knew that I wanted to be a professional basketball player, you know, when I was in high school, so I worked super hard every single day. So when I got done playing, it was just a natural progression to take what I had built myself into and try and help young players and older players work on their game so that they can achieve success in their passion of basketball. My name's Steve D'Agostino. I'm a graduate of the College of St. Rose in 2008, and I'm the owner of Dags Basketball. Dags Basketball is a basketball training company. We hold camps, clinics, and workouts for players as young as fourth grade all the way up to professional players in the NBA. So I started Dags Basketball in 2008, right when I got out of the College of St. Rose and went to go play professionally overseas. In the summers when I was home in the Albany area, I started training a group of high school players. Eventually I started training some of the local high schools. I trained Scotia High School, Shenandoah High School, who both went on to win state championships. And then it grew into me running bigger basketball camps for young players and high school players. You know, we train over a thousand players in New York, Connecticut, Vermont, Florida. We hold camps all over the place. And even last year, we held camps overseas in Barcelona as well. We've had a lot of really good players that have come through our program, a lot of good teams as well. We work with Kevin Herter, who's currently playing in the NBA for the Atlanta Hawks. Joe Primo, who played three years at UAlbany, scored over 1,500 points there, and then went on to finish his career at Villanova University. Andrew Playtack, who's now at the University of North Carolina. And we have several other players who have gone on to play at other Division I schools. My goal from when I was younger was always to be a professional basketball player. Garth Joseph, Damon Reed, Ralph Bucci, all these guys who have had great success at the College of St. Rose had gone on to have success overseas as well. So it was just kind of the natural progression that I had done so well at a great program and then now I was going to get the opportunity to follow those guys' footsteps and achieve my dream of playing overseas. The same way coaches can affect players' lives, trainers can do the same thing as well. You know, you can teach them how to be a leader, how to be accountable, how to fight through tough times. All those things that are within the game that not only help them become a better basketball player, but a better person as well.